U.S. Secretary of State Antony Blinken on Thursday appealed to the governments of Rwanda and Democratic Republic of Congo to respect each other's territorial integrity. His message comes after meeting Rwandan President Paul Kagame to discuss credible reports that Rwanda was supporting the M23 rebel group in neighboring Democratic Republic of Congo. My message to both President Chisekedi and President Kagame this week has been the same. Uh, any support or cooperation with any armed group in eastern DRC endangers local communities and regional stability. And every country in the region must respect the territorial integrity of the others. He added that Kagame and Congolese President Felix Tshisekedi had agreed to engage in direct talks to address the fighting. The U.S. senior diplomat is on a visit to Kigali less than a week after it emerged United Nations experts had found quote, solid evidence Rwanda has been interfering militarily in Eastern Democratic Republic of Congo. Rwanda's government has disputed the UN findings and has previously denied accusations by Congo that it supports the M23 and that it has sent troops into the country. The M23 has denied it receives Rwandan support. A target of the M23 and Rwandan operations in Congo has been the Democratic Forces for the Liberation of Rwanda, a Hutu militia which Rwanda accuses Congo of using as a proxy. Congo's government has denied this. Speaking alongside Blinken, Kagame said Rwanda would continue to defend its interests. And in Rwanda, we always reserve the right to take necessary measures to protect its, integrity, its territorial integrity, its sovereignty, and to ensure the security of its people. Adding that he hoped the U.S. would continue its support to bring peace to the region.